School football is back in parts of Central Texas. Tonight, many teams from around the area will square off under the Friday night lights. But there are some questions if schools would even be able to have a season. Nabil Ramanan spoke with coaches to see how practices have changed and what a game will look like during a pandemic. Wimberley High School is ready for another shot at the state title. Made a good run last year and got to the finals and didn't, didn't finish the deal. And so, uh, you know, we'd like to get back there this year and, and uh, be able to seal it this time. Blanco High School hoping to get there as well. You know, every game's tough and that's the way we like it. But it wasn't always clear if there would be football this season, as COVID-19 put a halt to many activities last spring. It's been a fluid situation and uh, we, just, we just try to keep them pumped up, keep them going and uh, do, do the best we can. Practices look different now for both teams. You'll see each player with a water bottle, also masks for everyone. And then put them up here around the nose. When it comes to fans, the stands won't be packed. The social distancing will still be the norm. At both Blanco High School and Wimberley, they'll allow 50% capacity. Wimberley also releasing this helpful list of rules for anyone attending a game. It's always a nervous nervousness when you're dealing with stuff like this, the unknown. But the coaches say they'll take one game at a time. You know, Friday night, there's going to be probably more more TV guys, more newspaper guys than there ever has been. Nabil Ramadna, KXAN News. 5A and 6A schools will start their season later this month. And